Alrighty. Oops, what did I just do? Okay, where was I? What were we doing? We were... Pit of Hollows. We just killed the tree, right? Dilapidated bridge. So we have to go back to the dilapidated bridge, I think. I think. Or is it Undead Settlement? No, it's... Yeah, it's dilapidated bridge. Alright, so we have to go up to where... Mr. Arrow Shoot Man is arrow shooting. He is a massive pain. I think I tried to fix the stuttering. I don't know if I did. Mr. Rat. Do the thing. It's apparently caused by uh, drivers for the controller that install themselves multiple times and swap between each driver as you play. So you have to uninstall all your USB drivers, keyboard, mouse, headset, controller, etc. Oh Jesus Christ! Not job. <laughs> and reinstall, and then I got to all of them. Only mouse was left, uninstall, reinstall, plug the mouse back in to reinstall its drivers. And it fucking reinstalled everything. So I did what anyone else would do in that situation and gave up completely and hope the problem doesn't ruin my videos. Simple, simple. Okay, I'm gonna aggro the big man. Because he wanders off, I think. Please. Please wander off. Uh, please. Yes. Goodbye. Die though. Who else wanders off? Do you wander off? Eh. Oh, what a shot. What have they got in their baskets? Come on, wander off. Wander, wander, wander. Jesus Christ! Ow! Okay, that made me jump. Fucking hell. Best move before the congregation comes back, actually. Hello. Gives me one second. Can I knock this fellow off? Large saw, lovely. Surely I can... Do this! Oh god. Oh god. Stop it, stop it. Okay, now. Can you drop anything? No. These two go nuts. Whew. Anything in the world? Life ahead. I doubt it. Shield up at all times. Ow. And kill the wolves. Useless. Actually garbage. This is like... I wonder if this is meant to be something you could get in at one stage. What's thing in there though? A bucket. And some pots. Alright. Carry on up. When we were uh, doing all the other stuff, there's a corpse. Oh, you can't see it. There's a corpse up here, on top of this cliff. There, hanging from that tree. That's where we got that flame plate ring or whatever it was. Or you cut the corpse down, it falls down here, and you've got to go all the way around without dying to get it. Massive pain in the ass. Hmm. Another one of those unkindled, are you? Such a voice. All you faceless undead, behaving as if you deserve respect. Here's the world, the demon's hmm. voice. No matter. Heed my words. If you've any sense, 
You go find a coffin to huddle up inside. You, here, in this land of hollows. You're like a frail maiden on the front lines. If, like the others, you're fool enough to play the champion, yes. then go on ahead. Trapes right past the abandoned church. Uh-huh. You'll face death. And it won't be pretty. Enough death to leave you broken. Time after time. Very cool. If like the others you think. <laughs> so he's acknowledging we die over and over again. Does not open from this side. I don't know how you get down there actually. Up we go. He likes taking a long time to open things. If you don't open. And the lift comes down. Goes up rather. Any stuff. And to the fan service from Dark Souls One. Hmm. 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 See inside the helmet, maybe. Oh. Kind of. Pardon me, I was absorbed in thought. I am Ziegvert of Katarina. Not seek to be my, honest, uh, seek I'm in a bit of a pickle. Have you ever walked near a white birch only to be struck by a great arrow? Well, if I'm not mistaken, they come from this tower. Whoever it is, I'm sure I can talk some sense into them. But I have to find a way up. And that's just the trouble. This lift only goes down, you see, and... Mm -hmm. uh, well... That doesn't get me anywhere. Hmm. Hmm. This lift, oh. I've got to use my head. So if you go on the lift, it goes down. Which is super. We want to go up. And we just saw it went up. So we go on this one. Puzzle solved. Is this portal? You have a look and hop down there. Did I do stupid? I think I might have done stupid. Yeah, I did. I did very big stupid. Ah, oh, heck. Um. Yeah, I've done big dumb. Oh, there's no way down, is there? Fuck. Ah, ball sack. I've done a, such a. I should have gone all the way to the top. I've got no way down. Therefore, time for friendship. I've ruined this. I'm gonna have to disbarge this. What? Go away. Um, I might have to homeward bone. That should be fine, actually. A homeward bone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're fine. Shrine bonfire, bonfire last rest of that. Because all the enemies will still be dead. Because I haven't sat at the bonfire, and I can just run back. Right. Right. Oh, for fuck's sake. I didn't sit at the bonfire. Oh my god, okay. I'll just run through. Oh my god, leave me alone. Nothing dropped. I'll just run on through. I should have gone all the way up the top of the tower. Instead of jumping off halfway. Oh, heck. Okay, you already jumped off. I can run through this, easy peasy. Nothing will go wrong. Oh, heck. Whoa, Jesus Christ. Whoa, Jesus Christ. That spooky man spooked me there. Gonna lay? Go on, keep running. Okay, he's still coming. Oh, he is! Help! You going up or down? Down. Oof, that's it, back up. Oh, Jesus! Stay, go away! Go, oh my god! Good 
Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh my god. Alright, calculated. Um where are we now? Up here. Bum bum bum. That's the giant shooting arrows at us down there in that graveyard. Just talk to him. Who are you? Make peace. I have any time. He gives you a young white branch. I have any time. That's it. Done. I thought there was an item up here, no? No item? Is it in here? No, nothing. Alright. So you talk to the giant, and then he doesn't shoot you anymore. Which is quite nice of him. I could have sworn there was something here. Hey, there we go. Step on this again. Now you hop off. Oh no, I did silly! I couldn't remember if he was there or not. So he goes up the lift after you talk to the giant. Right, 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 right. Oh, now we can actually do the thing I wanted to do. Pretty cool. Oh, we're not Ember, actually. One sec. Sit back down here for a sec. Oh, don't hit me. There we go. And we want to use an Ember. And now we go this way. Then we should get invaded by that guy, Hodrick or whatever his name was. No? He should be here. No? Am I missing something? There's an item I missed, so I'm going to go back and get that and I hope we get invaded. here. Aim at the thing, run and jump. There we go. A rusted coin times two. Why am I not getting invaded? Ow. Jesus. Ow again. Big cranky. I was supposed to get invaded here. No? What on earth? Why not? That is strange. So now we can go in here and he doesn't shoot at us. He actually shoots at everyone else. Right? There we go. Shoots at everyone but us. Apparently. There we go. Whoa! Kill that guy. Where are my arrows at? Hello? Is he shooting? There we go. Get some branches and stuff. Kinda like this sword. Better than the other one. Better than the claymore. Uh, you gotta jump over there and get that, and then jump back. Okay, that's fine. We won't die doing this. We will not die grabbing this item. See how the big, see how big this white soul is. That means it's more important than the other ones. Ooh, under bone shard. That's actually very, very good. Isn't that like more health per sup per gloogy? So we drag these guys out. Hello. You should take an arrow to the face soon. Oops a daisy. Round and round we go. Another big soul. Mortician's ashes. From Adam's family? Oh, there we go. See this. Whoa! Ow. Nico. Anything else? Touch bloods. 
sustained. Don't really care about how that guy died. Is this it? Not everything? Okay, we got some decent, unique stuff there. Head up here. Kill this gent. Bam, bam, bam. Is that it? Did we get that item there? Whoa, who the? So I saw someone. Actually going mad. You're supposed to go here. And then you're supposed to go... Or maybe you're not supposed to go there. Okay, and then we'll head on carrying on. Could go back to the bonfire and across under the bridge with the rats, but we'll go this way. It's just as easy. Might have to fight through the congregation. Oh, they're not even here. Oh, they're down there, they just spawned in. We can also run up these stairs before they get here. It's just her. It's just her. What the hell? Some congregation. Oh. You go down here. Take a drink. Isn't there a dog here? Yeah, there he is. Oh dear. Oh, they don't. They have a pot, and then they throw the pot at you, and then they take out their saws. That makes sense. Dum 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 da dum. Do you go up or down? Do you go up or down? You go up. Shh. I needed that. I need to pull the lever. Are they still coming? No, they're going. That's fine. So I just have to do this and go back up. Now we hop off. Wait, where are my souls? Hmm. Okay, the souls are all the way at the top. That's fine. Oop, there we go. Back down. Now we jump off. Hmm. <coughs> and Mr. Man is out here. There he is. Hmm. Hmm. Ah. Oh. Don't disappear like that. You had me downright worried. But thanks to you, an epiphany has struck me square in the head. Mm -hmm. I've unraveled the riddle of this inscrutable lift. <laughs> yep, you did it. All you. On some days, I begin to doubt myself. I went up the tower, so I thought, then somehow ended up here. I'm... Not exactly sure what happened. He fell. Anyhow, do you see that? That humongous beast? Your mum? I'm no coward and I have a steady hand, but that thing makes my skin crawl. How now? Think twice before you go down that road. I could try talking some sense into him. No, I think not. Is far too overheated. I've got to use my head and think. <laughs> so, like, I don't know why there's this guy back in the game. It's a different character wearing the same suit of armor. It's like an ancestor. But, like, same voice, same characteristics and mannerisms and stuff. This fan service is like... So, you jump down here. And I, you're supposed to fight this guy and then he helps you, I think. But I wonder what happens if you just shoot it. You should have waited! Well, I seek word of the Knights of Katarina! Fight by your side! Ready, ready. Kinda of stuck in a corner. The detail on the enemies is way better than dogs. Oh, 
buff and a buff and a buff. Easy enough. Buy a gem. And then he sits down. I think he has a little sleep or something. That was quite a performance. But you mustn't get in over your head. We unkindled must put our duties first. But for the moment, we've a toast to make. Mm, toast would be good right now. He gives you a drink emoji or whatever. My sword and our victory together. <laughs> he does like it. That's him holding up his cup, apparently. That's his toasting emoji. Well. I'm going to have myself a little nap. The only thing to do, really, after a nice toast. <laughs> Bit sad, honestly. People are like, yay! Sigmeyer or Sigford or whatever it is. I'm such a bro. Yeah. It's Dark Souls. It's, this guy's toasting and allows you to do a toast emoji. Blech. Yuck. Game is far too serious for that. Far too serious. Where are we at now? Shoot these things down. Like this. No? Oh, like this? Why didn't this one work? My last arrow now. It just hits off it. What on earth? But what if it's good? The northern set. Oh, that made me jump. Holy moly. Large club. These are really good weapons, actually, the clubs, as it happens. Go up here, just grab it, maybe? Pale tongue. If you get five of them and bring them to a woman, then you can uh, redo your stats. What's in here? What's in here? More stuff. It's not a very big soul this time, so it must be crap. Red book pellet. That's how you can tell if it's important or important or something. <coughs> Gonna go make coffee soon. And a toast. Are you real? No. I think the other ones are brighter. Oh, no, two different. Whoa, my game's freezing. Is it better? There we go. These two are different looking. Is it gonna drop down on me, probably? No. Can I jump attack them? I think you're real, but if I go for this item, you're gonna. There we go. How am I two shooting these things? What on earth? Alluring skull. I just punched the desk. Ow. What's my weapon type? Uh, equipment, broadsword, straight sword, standard. What was the claymore then? Standard thrust. How am I not using the claymore actually? 145 plus 48 for the Hollow Slayer Greatsword. Can I use it now? I can use it. Alright, we'll use this. So I can swing to the side and I can thrust. It's a bit slow though. The other one's like pow, pow. This one's kind of quick too. Oh, freezy. Now we're one shot dogs. Oh, god, dogs. I mean to kick him. A bit harsh. Is that moving? Is this moving? It is. Can I talk to you? Oh my god. Did that let me jump? Asshole. I need to look at the ceiling. Ugh. Didn't they all fall down? Not sure why they're not falling down. Is it because they're not... There's a chest. If I open it, they're gonna fall down. Yep, give me that. Okay, I do like this weapon, actually. I do like it. Whoop, freezing again. And there's two women. Two thingies. We could fight them. We could fight these. Oh, oh Jesus! Oh no! Maybe not. Oh my god. Okay, I've made a large mistake. Whoa, whoa! 
One at a time, please. Absolutely crab apple. Oh, it's just up there. What is it? It's a big item, so it must be important. Flynn's ring? What's that do? Oh, I've got loads of rings I should be wearing. Recovers, ha oh, recovers HP with successive attacks. Should be doing that. Uh, increases bleed resistance. Lowering equip load increases attack. I guess I put on increases fire damage and bleed resistance rings too. Lowering equip load increases attack. I mean, I guess I put that on too. Got four slots now. Oop. And then you drop down here. And then you drop down here. Take a drink. Probably where I'll die. I think if you want to do more drop down stuff. Dum -da -dum -dum -dum. How do you get in? This way. In here. And you got to. This is like the well in Dark Souls 2. How do you actually get down here? You just have to fall? Oh, I'm so gonna die. And roll off that, right? Yeah. Okay, for you. And give me the mirror set. Isn't that Lucatil from Dark Souls 2? Chlorinthy ring, okay. Out of here. Uh, probably this one. Increases damage absorption when HP is low. Yeah, we don't want to get too low HP. Let's put that one on. Stamina regen, lovely. Isn't that Lucatil of Mirror's corpse? Because we got her clothes just there. Oh, now we're fat rolling. How are we fat rolling? Because we put on a ring? 0 0.7, 0. So we just put on like 4 extra weight. Damn. Okay, but I can take this off. There we go. The bow. And here we are. Back at the congregation. Uh, but I want to go back to Filing Shrine. Briefly, I think. Oh, can't use that. Use Shrine Bonfire. Now, we've basically done this whole area, I think. There's nothing else to see in Undead Settlement. Pop on my souls. Uh, inventory. Pop you. 2000. Um again. Uh, da, 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 da. Pop, you selected. Because I want to buy the ladder. There we go. I think you talked to this woman. Ah, this woman. How may oh, you have to give her ashes. We found the mortician's ashes Gracious, before. Give them to her. Let this ash bestow nourishment. I only hope these new wares content thee. That's how you get like <laughs> armor and stuff. I don't really know how it works, honestly. So we gave her the mortician's ashes, and now she's got the mortician set or something, probably. Something. I'm not sure. She got something new in her shop that she wouldn't have had before. And to buy arrows as well. Uh, Twenty thousand is the tower key. But we can buy the grave key. Key to a door in undead settlement sewer. Okay, guess we're going back to the Undead Settlement. We weren't done as I thought. 
um, dried finger. So like all this stuff is uh, white sign soapstone lets you summon. Dried finger lets you summon someone else. Ashen one. So if I summon in John, for example, why well, I would want to do that, I don't know. And then I want to summon in Ryan. Then I can use a dried finger to uh, break the summon. Oh, I can burn that too. And get an extra person in where normally you're not allowed. No more. Okay. Travel. Uh, dilapidated bridge. But I, I think that guy didn't invade me. What the heck? Why no invade? Does he invade now? If I walk across this bridge? No? That's sad. Come on, rats. Attack. Oh, I bopped him on the head. Okay, now we got the key for this door, I think? No, this door. Like that. Is this where I'm meant to be going? Is this a bad place? Am I gonna get absolutely curb stomped? A loincloth. Pray to the statue of Velka. Who's Velka? Absolution. You have not sinned. Your curse can be lit. Oh, you can reverse hollowing. So if you've used all the embers in the world, in the game, oh, what's in here? That's where I came from. Then you can go down here and become hollow again. Okay, that's like their fail safe. The devs fail safe, I guess, against people running out of embers. Red tilted halberd. Red hilted halberd. Cool. Wouldn't mind trying out some different weapons and stuff. Halberds and all that crack. These are all different colours, so I'm guessing you're coming to life. Dear, oh dear. Anyone else? Start with this chap. Whoa! Take that. So, ow. else. Okay, head on down. It's gonna come to life, so... I can't attack him on the ground now. There we go. Oh, Jesus. Big tree, man. This way. Ugh, this camera's so fast in this game. That's how we get down here. Oh, look, it's your man. Oh, and your woman. I'll deal with you first. How do you have no health? Who's missing health? She's missing health. What the? Okay. You can jacksy these people. They're really hard to, though. Oop, excuse me. Oh, it's a Titanite demon. Shit. Or a Titanite squid. Phew. Gimme. Heavy game. Titanite shot. Oh, sweet lord. Woo. Quite a plunging attack us. What was that guy doing there, too? Guess not. Need 20,000 souls for the ladder key thing. Ooh, I don't have any arrows at all, do I? I've got throwing knives. Will they work? No, oh, hold on. Equipment. Uh, have I got any, any arrows at all? No. But I've got bolts, but no crossbow. Fuck. Can I put any throwing knives into these? Damn. Please be a crossbow in here somewhere. Hello, rat. Oh god. Oh, for fuck's sake. Swing your sword. 
It's like the rat vanguard in Dark Souls 2. Oof. Saint's talisman. Actually useless. This is where that maiden was imprisoned. Here, I believe. Hello. Uh, who is there? Me. Patrick. Someone there? Anyone? Tis I. Oh, please. Whoever you are, touch me. Um. The dark surrounds me, nibbles at my flesh. That's not dark, that's rats. The creatures, they never stop biting. So please, hold out your hand and touch me. Okay. Bop. Oh, yes, there you are. So close, indeed. But I'm human, so I'm made of dark. And I am not entirely alone. Just yet. Praise the merciful gods above. Okay. Oh, forgive me. I am Irina of Karim. Hello, Irina. Of I came Karim. to this land so that I might be a firekeeper. You I am weak oh, I skipped. and unfit Sorry. to tend the flames. But if it would not trouble you. Hey. Might I enter into your service instead? Well, oh, thank can't say no you, to sweet that. champion. I shall take my vows. I, Irina of Karim, solemnly swear to serve you. Cool. Thanks. Got a crossbow, by the way. Okay, what's the size of the. Oh. You've gone and rescued her, have you? How very quaint. Pitying creatures that are beyond help. <laughs> yeah. Good old chuckle. Very well. I'm sick of looking after her at any rate. Uh -huh. I am Egon, a knight of Karim. I am allied to you for as long as you assure the girl's safety. Cool. And only for that long. What's the matter? Ow. My terms are very it's just simple. so cool. I am allied to you for as long as you assure the girl's safety. And only for that long. <laughs> You're so cool. Don't know if that's a key item or not. Can I drop down onto something and get it? I'll come back at some stage. We'll carry on, though, in our adventure. And probably die at this next bit, because it's fucking hard. Now we have to go down the lift. Going down. No, not going down. So we've done all the loops. This is probably my favourite area of the game, just because it's like Dark Souls 1, it loops around, it's very Metroidvania-esque. And people like Dark Souls 1 for that, they're like, oh, the map is so well designed, it, like, all the areas return on themselves. Like, that's what a Metroidvania does. Anything here? So you go out here, and there's this boreal dancer dude, like the boss we killed, Vort. Whoop, game frozen. He's in there. And, uh, he's hard as balls. He's just legit hard as balls. So the strategy to kill him... Oh, we can take that, I think. Is dodge, or not. Run to the door. And open the door. go through. And he cannot go through. We'll light the fire just in case I'm wrong. And then he can't do shit. Ooh -hoo -hoo. <laughs> so, Jesus, he's very spooky. I'm going to sit down and fight him. Mano el mano. Frostbites you as well. If he touches you. Oops. It's best not to block. So I'm gonna just whoop. Cheese him a bit. Wait for the frostbite to run out. I think you just instantly freeze to death. You can set him on fire, I think. Do we have like fire bombs? 
We do have some firebombs. We can try that. Nah, doesn't do too much. Best just to just dodge him, don't let him hit you. Ow. Not a great dodge there, honestly. Whoops! We're all missing today. There he goes. And he gives you a cool sword. Irithyll Straight Sword. And it's like made of ice, and it freezes people the same way he's trying to freeze you. It's not better than the one we have though, I don't think. Which one is it? This one. The worst damage, but it does... Uh, every Outrider Knight one day devolves into a beast. They g Pontiff Sullivan, the sacrifice dude, gives these people rings. The left eye ring and the right eye ring and the ruby ring and the sapphire ring or whatever it is. And they eventually turn into beasts. That's why that Vort boss was like a dog. They were knights and then they turn into dogs. Weird. Uh, weapon is enshrouded in frost and causes frostbite. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool, honestly. Standard and thrust and what was it? Standard and thrust. It is kind of cool, but it is weaker. This is a great sword, and that's only a straight sword. I think we'll give the straight sword a little go for the time being. The lucerne, red hilted halberd. They're all kind of cool. They are all kind of cool quicker too. It's all frosty. Um, we will go back to Filing Shrine, buy some arrows. Travel, Filing Shrine. Buy arrows, shoot down that corpse, and then go back to this bonfire. I think that's the way. Look at my sword. So cool. Hello. Uh, purchase arrows, please. Uh, we'll get 20 or so of them. 30 will do. Ashen one. Do I have arrows now? Yes, I do. And then we go to Road of Sacrifices. Up the lift. Shoot down the corpse. And we're good to go. Gargoyle Flame Hammer. Cool. So you're supposed to pay attention to the story, and the crestfallen knight says to follow the road of sacrifices to and see where it leads you. But he does say the clerics have been putting people, children included, into wagons and bringing them on the road of sacrifices, which I think is the undead settlement's purpose. That's where they come from, I think, so that the sludge monster can eat them. Because he wants to uh, eat everyone, because everyone's got a little bit of dark in them, so he's like, if I eat everyone, I'll get the dark soul. I'm pretty sure that's his motive. And uh, I quit my bow. Take that out. Aim it quick. What the? Oh, the arrows are in the wrong slot. Really weird. Dark souls 2 moment just there. And up. Go down here. I jump down there without dying. No, there's no way. In here, down here. Run away from the rats. Oh shit. Didn't think it was that high up. Oh, I can't one shot rats anymore. Oh heck. Possibly could farm embers off them. Boing, boing. And... Blessed red and white shield plus one? Is it good? No, it's terrible. What does it do? Repel an attack at the right time to follow up with a... It's a parrying shield. Okay, actually useless. Homeward bone. Uh, bonfire last rest of that. Okay, at least we knew what it was. If we were into parrying, which we're not, because we're not Ryan, we'd use that. We might try, though. Maybe, at some stage. Sit down here. And off we go. I, do I want to level up this sword? Not sure. It's not one-shotting things, and I do like one-shotting things. 
This area is a massive pain in the hole. And scary as fuck. That did a critical. Oh yeah, so I hit him like twice and it did very little damage. And the third time it caused him to have frostbite. And it fucked him up. So it did a lot of damage. That was very nice, I do like. Did I miss an item? Yes I did. Big one. Shriving stone. It's down here. Soul of an unknown traveler. Go up here. And there's another guy down there, right? There he is. Bop. Give him the box. Oh, witchy foot. There we go. Exactly 15,000 souls. Look at that. That is tasty. Watch me lose them now in a second. I should definitely not have come here with 15,000 souls. I will aggro one of these at a time with the bow. Or I'll attempt to. No. No aggro for me. Okay. Hiya! Guys got mad. You can't see the frostbite meter on them though. It's a bit of a pain. Thank you. Just three hits. You just kind of know that three hits does the job. You can go down here. Is it where you're supposed to go? Not sure if I'm supposed to go down here or I'm supposed to go the other way. Oh my god. Silly flippy man. There's nothing down here. Okay. That looks silly now. What's down here? De -de 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 -de. You go left and you go down, and there's a butcher woman, right? Take that, brigand axe. There she is. Use me. Frostbite meter. Oh god, she's fucking powerful. There we go. Oh no! How? I have my shield up. Must be a weapon thing. Oh god! Oh my good god. Not even close. And now she gives you the butcher knife. Big strength weapon. And the brigand trousers. I don't know why that character's in every Dark Souls game. The naked butcher lady. She's down by, uh, she's in Blight Town in Dark Souls 1, and she's in Blight Town in Dark Souls 2 as well. So I'm guessing this is what Blight Town became. She's in the, the depths or the gulch or whatever it was in Dark Souls 2. I'm guessing that's what this place must be then. Because she appears in the same place. That's what they like to do. The significance there. Oh, hello, gents. I'm gonna take a quick one of these. Okay, at least it's a one, two, three for each of these. So they shriek, and they power power up everyone in the area. And they come running at you, and it's fucking scary. I want to aggro one at a time. That guy in the back there powers up everyone. Let's see if he comes at me now. Hopefully. Come on. Oh, what? No. You're coming to fight, surely. There we go. They spawn these wings and then they go Super Saiyan. It's very spooky. No? Come on. Come, 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 come. Surely we're not afraid. Is he stuck on something? 
Oh, I hit the wrong guy. No. Oh, no, no. I have mistaken. Okay, that's one. I'm taking my very sweet time here. Because there's lots of guys that I can't see that he screams and then they all run at me with their transformed state. Bop. Right in the noggin. You can run past, but... It's easier not to. I can hear them down there as well. Underneath me, down that path. They're just not coming. Come on. Both here at this stage. I just don't want to aggro that guy. Go on. Oh, I missed. My god. This could be a while. But I do not mind. All the time in the world taking care of these fucking guys. I'm not doing any damage though. Can I kill that guy with arrows? No, there's no way. There's the scream. It didn't affect them though. Oops, I wasn't looking. I think I have to just run past. I'm gonna put all my arrows into this guy, run past. See if I can just slap him. And then pray. And last arrow. Okay, surely a couple of slaps will be fine to kill. Okay, never mind. Now they've decided they want to fucking transform. Here we go. Thank god. That kills me so many times. Now then, you screamy fuck. Nah, 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 nah. Ember, is that all? Oh my god. What's up here then? Nothing. Anything over there? No. Okay, we'll go down the path. There's actually a bonfire just down there. We'll go down here anyway. Oof. Spook, man. How do I get to you? How do I get to that path? Illusory wall? No. How do I get up there? How's he done now? Do I just have to jump down or something? Hmm. Let's take up there. Up here? Gotta be a way. There's a bonfire right there. With Henri and Horace, I believe, is their name. The Blue Sentinels. This is how you talk, by the way. <laughs> oh, hello. How do you do? I'm Anri of Astora. Unkindled like you. It's a guy. Oh, because I picked Horace, a woman. A friend and travelling companion. So, uh, I picked a woman character, this a female character. Well I've normally picked a male classes. character, and Anri Below is a female then. Is the crucifixion woods. Beyond the flooded woods lies Farron Keep, home of the Undead Legion. Further yet is the Cathedral of the Deep. We seek the Cathedral, home of the grim Aldrich. We may go our separate ways now, but we are both seekers of lords. The next time we cross paths, 
one may find the other in a time of need. May the flames guide your way. Thank you. Oh, yes. Horace. He's not very talkative. But don't think ill of him. He is an upstanding, kind-hearted knight. A fine partner for this grueling journey. Without his help, I would have cursed this onerous duty long ago. Anything else? We are well along the road of sacrifices. Below us is the crucifixion woods. Beyond the flooded woods lies Farron Keep. We met the... Okay. So. 17,000. Do we have any souls to pop? Of two of these? Give us up to 20,000. So close. So close. Okay, we've got to get some more. But how do you get up there? This is the crucifixion woods. Don't you get invaded here? That's for sticks. Coming in. 150 each. Huh? Uh, you don't want to drop down there because then it's really hard to get back. I just need a few hundred more. A couple of more baddies will be fine. Oh! Baddies! There's a baddie in particular. Hello, Stickman. And I'll take you out. Thank you. Titanite Shard. Alright, now we have 20,000. Whoops, ran out of stamina. Uh, I don't want to kill that guy. I want to just go back. To Firelink Shrine and buy the ladder for 20,000 souls. I wonder if you can skip it. Yeah, I think they've patched the skip. How do I get up there? Oh, they've gone. Sick. Thanks, thanks so much, guys. Oh, I didn't even light the bonfire. Whoops. That could have gone bad. Uh, travel, Firelink Shrine. Ladder time, ladder time, and I know what you're thinking. I wonder if Ladder McGinty is here, selling me the ladder. Fortunately, no. Oh, we'll talk to this person as well. Hmm. You're an unkindled, aren't you? Mm -hmm. I am Sirius of the Sunless Realms, former servant of the Divinity. Duties we each bear. Bear. But one's duty is a solitary affair. A fair. I doubt we've much to gain from fraternization. I'll give it a try. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. Blessing of the moon? That's a Gwyndolin thing. I doubt we've much to gain from fra- Blessing of- Cirrus of the Sunlight Realm, or whatever it was she said. Ah, how? Hmm. That's a Gwyn. A Gwyn's son. Raises a girl under the moon or something. Okay, one. so now we got this. We go- How do you get out of here? This place is always a maze to me. Out here, and up here? I uh, know, out here and out here, you gotta wait for it to load. I think. Yeah, it just doesn't like loading. Oh my god, let me out already. There we go. Um, we go down here. And we fight the master. Kill these guys first, because they get in the way. Stuff. Cleric Sacred Chime. Ember. Cool. Oh, can I go to the tree now? Where is it? It's over here. Oh, it's up there. The other entrance. Down. Go over here. Dum de dum de dum. Might die. This guy's tough. A fading sword. This guy guards that tower. And now he is aggro. Oh, run away. Don't want to fight him just here. Oh, there's an item there I missed as well. Because I might fall off the edge. There's the frostbite. Guard him with that. 
get some stamina back. Oh, another one. There we go. Okay, not so tough. And from him you get Uchi Katana. More like Ouchi Katana when I use it. East West Shield. Is that any good? Nope, terrible. Uh, it's parrying shield again. I think this is. We bought the key for 20,000 souls, so let's just get in here. Nope. Okay, so it's over this way then. I do look like a snow zombie, I have to say. The white skin and the sword. The sword. Uh, it's in here, isn't it? No, nope, it's underneath. Oh my god, the maze of this place. Up here, in here, down there. And then we go right and up the stairs here. Through here. And I think once you get in once you get invaded, you can get a seed from the giant tree. Like so. That ladder is not complete. This tower is locked. Go in the tower. Dumdy dum de dum. Wow, beautiful, a beautiful view. What a beautiful view. It is a beautiful view. I think you can jump onto the roof here. But we'll go this way first, will we? Will we go this way first? Nah, we'll drop down. Like so, kick the ladder. Like that. Oh, bare feet. Jesus Christ. Go over here. There's a nest here, see? You... You... Me... Me... Pickled Pea... Me... Me... Pumperum... Two crows called Pickle Pea and Pumperum. And you trade with them. Isn't it great? You're supposed to go in here. Is it this? No. Might be a gap. Yeah, there's a gap there. Keep going anyway. There's one over there. No. Okay, so we go in the gap, I think. Like so. And we get that. Ooh. Without falling off. I think you trade with them here. Give me that. Esther Shard. And then you drop your stuff. So you can drop rubbish, I think, is one thing you can drop. No, no, that no pickle pea, that no pump or rum. So they don't like rubbish. What do they like then? Do they like a lucky coin? Want a coin? Even one. I don't like coin either. Oh well. Um, I think you go over here and you slap this wall. There we go. And then you drop down there. And there's a chest. Is it a mimic? Don't think so. Cover to silver serpent ring. Put that on instead of this one. It's the one that gives you more souls. Is there a thingy here as well? No. That's it. Is it this one? I thought there was two. Illusory walls. So that opens up the trading. And, uh... Oh, guy. Cool. Mm. Unkindled, are we? And fast on the trail of the Lord's absconded. Then these red eyes are for you. It looks like he's from Bloodborne, apparently. Use them to pillage embers and briefly heighten your strength for your duty. What else are unkindled ashes good for? <laughs> pillage embers for briefly heightened strength. What else are unkindled? <laughs> cool. Here gives you cracked red eye orbs. Let you invade players. If you are an asshole. And I am an asshole, so we'll be doing that at some stage. All right, what are we at? An hour and five minutes or so. We'll level up the sword a tiny bit before we go. We need some arrows. Ah. 
We've run out of arrows again. By 30 of them. I'll go for 50. Ashen one. Talk to the chap. Ah, tis good, wasn't he? Um, can I reinforce? Oh, I can. Infuse weapon. Infuse the claymore with something. Or can I infuse it with reinforce weapon? Okay, what am I using? Does it say? Irithyll straight sword. That's that one, isn't it? Twinkling tight knife, but I have none. Pretty be careful. Okay, we'll come back to you. And for now, we will sit. What's next? Keep going through the crucifixion woods. Invade some more. Kill invaders, hopefully. Do boss. But for now, I'll tab. I'll click.